is Madison and welcome back to my channel. It is currently about 6.40. I woke up a little while ago, just made my bed, made some breakfast, and got some iced coffee going. And today I'm gonna take y'all along with me. I have a class, I am working at both of my jobs, I have a club on campus, so I thought today could be an exciting time to bring y'all along, show you what a day in my life looks like as an aerospace engineering student and employee for the university. I am at the point where I'm on campus almost every single day now, but regardless, I still thought today would be a fun time to show y'all. So let's go. Keep all your game, as and lost, as and lost. It's all the same. Since I am going into work today, I think I'm going to put on a little bit of makeup. I have two jobs. I work as like an undergraduate engineer for this lab and then I also am an aerospace engineering ambassador where I work in the admin office. Typically when I work in the admin office, I try to just a little bit nicer, but sometimes that's hard when I work. For example, today I'm working at the admin office for five hours. I have a five minute break and then I'm going to work at the lab. So I kind of need to have what I wear match both moods. Um, so I need to be a little bit dressier and nicer, but I also need to not have like a shirt that I'm gonna catch on fire, soldering or something like that. So. So I have class in an hour, exactly. I am debating if I'm gonna do some yoga or not. I don't know, I think I could definitely use a little stretch, but at the same time, I have homework due tonight that I haven't finished yet. And I'm working seven hours today. 
and no, I'm working a little over six hours today. And I have a club later. I have robotics later. So we'll see. I don't know. I think I might do just like, oh my gosh. And maybe get back to work and do some class and things like that. Um, um my room is a mess i think i'm gonna clean up a little bit i might do like a tiny little stretch and then um i need to read my textbook Oh, okay, I just finished my little 11 minute yoga flow morning yoga video with Adrian. If y'all have not watched yoga with Adrian's videos, I highly recommend them. Um, she has so many great yoga videos for literally every single occasion. Um, and her morning ones, like her short little morning ones, I absolutely love. So I just finished that up. It was short and sweet, but let's see, it is now. 7.54, which gives me time to do a few things before my class at 8.30. I got my iced coffee here. I mixed it with some black coffee that was left over just because it didn't steep very well. I don't know if I didn't put enough coffee in. Whatever. It'll still be good. So my class just started. Woo! Um, it is a Zoom lecture, obviously. Well, lecture. This typically is my lab time for one of my classes, um, but they're doing like 30 minutes of senior design presentations, and then you're off the rest of the class because of the spring pause. So my lab group and I are meeting after that, um, and then I'm gonna go to work. I typically have three classes on Mondays and Wednesdays. So I have this class, which is my vehicle design and performance lab. Then I have my dynamics and systems lecture, and then I have my computer systems lecture. However, like I said earlier, I don't go to lectures anymore. Um, so for two of my classes, the vehicle design and computer systems, it's a flipped classroom. So they pre-record the lectures. And then the typical lecture time is like office hours. Um, and then for my dynamics class, they have legitimate lectures. Like I said earlier, I've just been reading the textbook. That is working really well for me. I get so much more out of doing like the textbook readings and practice problems on my own as opposed to actually going to lectures. So um, I'm not totally paying attention to this. Again, it's just senior design presentations. I feel kind of bad. There's like 140 kids in my class and only 39 of us are here. Um, so at least I'm here, at least I'm trying. Um. just finished meeting up with my lab group um only about half of my group showed up and everybody said they were going to be there which is honestly really frustrating but i guess that's why peer evals exist because you made a commitment to your group either way um i just packed up some snacks like i said i made myself um like 
lunch for today last night, which is nice, so I didn't have to worry about that. Um, I got all of my essentials for the day, and yeah, I think I'm about ready to head into work. I've got a jacket and a sweatshirt just because it's like 30 something degrees outside and the lab gets really cold in the afternoon. So, um, yeah. Okay. I don't have a tripod, so here we are. I am in my car. It's a little bit snowy, not terribly. Um, it's pretty much like all melted on the roads, which I have mixed feelings about. I'm <laughs> like, if it's gonna snow, give us a lot of snow just because we need it, the droughts and stuff like that. But um, here we are. So I am on my way to work, like I said, um, I'm an aerospace ambassador, so in a typical semester, like a not COVID semester, I sit at the front desk, um, that kind of thing. But right now with COVID, I just kind of help in the admin office do packages, mail, dishes, make coffee, like random things like that. Um, so I will take y'all along today. The nice thing is I end up being able to do homework for typically over half of my shift. So. I am currently sitting down to do my tutor session <clears throat> this is for my dynamics class and i do this once a week they're only 30 minutes but it's free which is really nice and i can just kind of get some extra help on like last week's material that i did not understand so 